One-time top model Angie Harmon, along with Sasha Alexander, who is best known for her roles on NCIS and Dawson's Creek. They're here to talk about a new series that's airing on TNT that everybody seems to be tuning into. Here to talk about the success of Rizzoli and Isles are the two stars themselves. Ladies, tell us what, uh, what makes your so, so, show so popular. The, the things that make our show uh, popular is actually, you know, there are the characters, there's Jane and Mora, and then there's the relationship between the two of them. And, and sort of like how New York was a character on Law and & Order and on um, Sex and the City, the relationship between these two characters has sort of become the third character. It's, it's become its own entity. And I think people really respond to it. They love it. They, um, they love these, these women together. Um, you know, they're very, very different, but they uh, obviously come together in, in, you know, their jobs to keep the, solve the crimes and to, you know, bring order back to the city. Um, and then, you know, the beautiful thing about this is, I mean, Sasha and I both have been on crime shows where it's just sort of the crime, and then everyone, you know, like the five talking heads standing around the body talking about, well, the trajectory of the bullet came from there and it went over there and, you know. But in our show, I mean, we not only have that, but we also have their backstories and their families and their love lives and things like that. So it's, I think it's a, it's a really nice balance between their professional lives and their personal lives, which you don't often see. Well said. Thank you. I wish she would watch our show. I think she'd really like it. <laughs> I promise I'm going to tune in. Uh, it sounds like you guys have a lot of fun. See? <laughs> so did you guys have a relationship? Did you know each other before the show? No. No, we didn't. We had mutual friends, though. Yeah. Well, Weren't you working out with Tracy? And, and yes. Yeah. Yeah. When I showed up and told her, I got this job, and I'm working with Angie Harmon. She's like, I love Angie Harmon. Yeah. And I, and I worked with a, a man a few months prior, a lovely actor, a few months prior to... Uh, to doing this show who I was working with him late one night and he said oh you're funny have you ever worked with Angie Harmon I said no he goes oh you got to work with her that's the most I ever laughed in my life you two got to get together and it was like a few months later and I, I auditioned and Angie was cast and um, I got to read with her and she played a joke on me immediately immediately <laughs> it was great it was fun well from listening to you girls talk it sounds like you really hit it off like you have some good chemistry we do uh, Andy, I think, uh, so you're best known for your role on Baywatch Nights and Law and & Order, of course. Uh, you said you worked on things similar. Were you really prepared for a role like this? Did you see your career going in this direction? Um, I do hope I get to wear more bikinis, because I just find that that really was just the high point of my career. Um, no, it's, to be very honest, um, you know, I, I don't know that there was really any direction. I mean, I think as actors, we're sort of gypsy-esque, you know what I mean? I think you, you know, you find projects that sort of call to you and that you love, and, um, I don't know. I mean, they, it, apparently I have a flair for playing, you know, strong law enforcement type people. So, <laughs> I guess, I don't know. I was very, very flattered that, that TNT, you know, came to me with it, and I've enjoyed it immensely, and I've gotten to, you know, work with wonderful, talented actress like Sasha, like Bruce McGill, like Lorraine Bracco. Um, and, you know, I mean, I'm just, I'm really, really thankful for it. But, you know, out of, out of everything to be said about it, I've, you know, that's just kind of it. And for its success, I mean, that's, you know, the fourth season is, uh, is always something to be thankful for. Sasha, talk about uh, your role on, on the set of Rizzoli and Isles. What is it like uh, working and working with Angie? Well, we worked, you know, many hours a week, 12 to 15 hours a day together. So when the day's over, we go home to our families, you know. I'm gonna I go to her with house. our kids, but she comes over. <laughs> I do. I get right in between her and her hubby, and I just <laughs> snug up, and it's the best. Because I missed her on the drive home. <laughs> I did. All right, ladies, so as we close, tell us uh, when and Tuesday, where we can catch uh, the 9 show. 9 p.m. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. on TNT. On TNT. Awesome. Thanks so much for joining us today, and congratulations on the success of your show. We will have all of this information on our website. That's going to be at fox4morningblend.com. So Angie's the jokester. All right. We'll be right back after one last look at your Fox 4 cast. Stay with us.